Well, today I started replacing some dead trees in the orchard. We replaced a total of 20. And I had my boys helping me. And you can see my seedlings in the back of the ATV. And we would go from tree to tree and make sure that it was alive and healthy. And here we got a tree growing. And that one's about seven, eight foot tall. This is six foot tall, six and a half foot tall at the top of that tube. There's a frost damaged plant. Struggling to make it. And then just right next to it, same variety of tree. Bent over from the wind, but looks good. Got my boy mowing too. Got a family thing going on today. No thumbs up from the free queen, free teenager. blooms here on the tree. It's going to be a first year hopefully to get nuts. You can see quite a few. You go up the tree. Beautiful tree. That's my orchard on June 1st, 2017. Another breezy day here, right at 70 degrees. We mowed up all the paths, making it look more like an orchard. It's a gorgeous day here. We've been replacing our trees that are either dead or obviously infected with blight. I think that totaled less than 15 trees total out of the 310. And I have plenty left to plant but I'm going to put these in a nursery situation to fill in next year. So here are some of those that I've gone there about 18 inches tall. The far rows that you can see over there have trees growing out of them two three foot out of the top of the six foot so I anticipate they'll be 10 11 12 foot by the end of the year those are the trees that I planted in the spring of 2015 those are the pure Chinese all the rest are coming close to the top of their five foot tubes some are coming out of the top for example this is a seedling I planted just in the spring of 2016 I'm sorry, I've got to correct myself. That was also a seedling, a seed that I planted in the early spring 15. So it grew all 15, all 16, and now it's entering its third year, whereas those on the far side had already had one growing year and I planted them as a bare root. This one was a chestnut ridge of Pike County chestnut, which is the American Chinese hybrid, and they only planted Dunstan, so Without saying it's a Dunstan, it's from only Dunstans. So some of those are starting to come out of the tops and you can see across this orchard, there's quite a few that have done that. Gorgeous day. Hope you're having good planting success. Haven't seen any of your updates lately, so maybe I'll make a post seeing if you guys can post some of your success or failures like mine with frost damage. I don't know that I had any actual frost kills now that I look at it. It was very close, but I think most of them are going to make some sort of recovery. Thanks for watching.